Hi, this is Lachimi Kantiwari. Welcome back to your new video tutorial. Previously, we have designed a progress bar, circular as well as a horizontal. In this video tutorial, I am going to show you how you can design an alert dialog. So I have created an Android application named as alert dialog. So this is alert dialog, therefore we do not need to do anything into our main activity XML or you can say the activity main XML file. We can create our alert dialog directly by coding into Java. So let me first show you what is the dialog. So the alert dialog has a title bar and the message and then one positive and the negative button. Right? So you can press on the positive or in the negative button whatever you want so we are going to create a sample of this alert dialog so let's choose this one okay so are you sure you will lose all photos and media so first of all we need to create alert dialog right so here it's a alert dialog and uh, we are going to select alert dialog sub android.support.v7.app and then you can see here alert dialog right and then we are gonna choose alert dialog.builder okay so alert dialog.builder and then this is the builder now I am coming into on create method inside on create method builder is equal to new alert dialog dot builder ok so alert dialog dot builder and then we want to pass the activity that is this activity right so that is the context of this activity then we are going to set the message to this builder but first we need to set the title so the title is are you sure ok so the title is are you, oops are you sure as you see the title is are you sure and then we are going to set a message so the builder dot set message so the message we are going to see uh, set there you will lose okay so you will okay so here you will lose all photos and media right you will lose all photos and media so this is our message and uh, now let's say here builder dot uh, one more thing I just uh, alert dialog is equal to builder dot create okay now it would create alert dialog and then we want to show it alert dialog dot show. Let's run this application and you will see there. So the first time it is being initialized so it may take some time. I am selecting Nexus 5 which is, which is running Android Lollipop. So it is taking to initialize uh, it is taking some time while getting started in meantime I would like to explain few more things to you as you see there there is a title and the message and then positive and negative button so I have created here title and message but I haven't created positive and negative button yet let me create that positive button first builder dot set positive button and then I need to create its erase is a positive that means it is going to do erase however Google do not suggest to do this but we have started to build this one so let me finish it it's not uh, uh, according to the Google guidelines that means the context a message is actually not uh, according to the Google 
guidelines but designing etc is almost uh, i mean it's uh, according to the google guidelines in case of hard you sure google says that it doesn't actually convey actual meaning what uh, system will do when user press erase or cancel button so let's keep it on and uh, insert positive button write erase and then you know this is like a uh, uh, button click listener so i would like to write here new on click listener then it will automatically implement the rest of the function for me and in the same manner i can set a cancel button that's the negative button write here a cancel i can write in lower case or in upper case by default this will be shown into upper case directly into your mobile application now this is being shown without this was the earlier message i mean this was earlier application when i started uh, uh, my first time this emulator now let me write something on click dialog interface uh, inside this override function so this will be executed if i press a positive button and uh, a toast will be displayed there which will be showing you all photos and media erased and of course if i press the cancel it must not show anything else okay so just delete this toast message or uh, for the testing purpose we can just show you that user has pressed the cancel so this is just for the testing purpose but actually if you implement uh, as a professional application then if you user press a cancel then application must not show any any toast how you were you can perform any other operation as you wish application is installing in nexus emulator emulator which is running nexus phone and let's wait for it it is launching activity and yeah as you see here are you sure you will lose all photos and media cancel and erase if i press on erase it will show all photos and media erased that means it is executed successfully and in a similar way you can perform whatever action you want to perform only you need to put that method call inside that override function or you can write that function completely inside that override function it's completely depend on you so i am going to stop this video tutorial here and uh, i'll be covering more video tutorials on alert dialog button snag bar toast etc so thanks for watching this one and stay tuned for next one bye bye have a nice day